It's uh, Twisted Minds first of the scene, but it looks like Liquid Echo are able to answer back. Yep, yeah, jumping in for their airstrike as well to zone them out. No and Fury already catching two, and that's going to be called TZ securing the first turtle of the game. They walk away, and all that's left in is just dust, no kills, and a couple of flickers. How uncanny. This is uncorrect. Oh, oh, I was about to say. Four Looking at the uh, XP gains again. This is what Carl Teasy got away with that small steal. Oh, no! Speaking of small steel, Hoda is able to get on out of them. No one furies by just enough time for Cuffin to really get the damage down. TL, PH, they gotta be careful here. Sanji, this is starting to take a little too long here. He's gonna get some true damage onto Carl and Teasy, and there's not gonna be a lot for him to do. He's gonna be popping the alt as well as Sanford is zoning out three people. And Carl Teasy, shield unity is out of there like nothing ever happened. Sanji will end up falling. He's almost there. There goes Sanji as well. Oh, so close. Sanford will die as a trade, but worthwhile, so very worthwhile as Benny QT is part of the mix as well. Troll in the middle of it, but they're airstrike once again, and it looks like they've overstayed their welcome to heal from JP is looking good, but Benny Cutie, oh, oh, good movement. He flickers away on top of the dash, and Troll jumps in forward. They're not letting him get away for free. And the Filipino squad walks away with another free turtle up top. Great flank, Sato. He's trying to get on out of there, but Sanji, he's still able to find it, but Yoda able to find JP in the process. Okay, at least they find the trade, but no, Sanji says one more for me. Does he? Troll is in school for medicine, man. Oh, oh no! All no. oh, that medicine won't bring Cuffin back in the time. I'm seeing on the opportunity as once again, they're gonna dive Sano underneath this tier one. No opportunities for you as Benny QT. Uh, you become a bullet sponge. Uh, uh, he's already taken so well, many bullets, but now Benny QT trying to outplay the situation by himself. Single-handedly turning it around. JP supporting him and Benny only don't die here. Now, they're coming in. Oh, Ooh. no. Tuffin, he's got him in the back. Oh. And now, they're all forced to go away. Sado finds the return of shutdown onto Sanji. He's been QT, takes out Sado as well. It's going to be a 3v4 situation as Yoda. He's trying his best, recharging that energy to keep the six. Them and even if those Knights did draw first blood, the rest of Liquid Echo, no, oh. it's up like this. Oh, the play once again. Sending in the right targets. Even the Minoan Fury is just a little too late. But their airstrike doesn't find anything off of this. The flank, the diversion from Liquid Echo, making it seem easy. Hoda is trying his best to clear that way, but it's too late. The crystal might just fall here. No more minions. He buys a little bit of time, but the inevitable is happening. Benny QT still staying alive. And finally, Hoda is able to shut him down. Liquid Echo. Oh, look at the bot side of the map. This might just be first blood here. It's called easy. Benny QT going for a clean dive. Gets the knockup as well. Ooh, up in, and then finally the basic attack, final slash starting it up. Oh, they're pushing back, but Sanji makes the opportunity into a bigger play here with the final slash stolen away onto the Twisted Minds of Sanji. He should be going down, but he still is able to walk out. Sanji is trying to get closer to him. Sanford is the one who finds it. And Cuffin steals away the turtle. And Benigo now- still did eventually get the turret down bottom. Now in mid, oh, threatening it. Throw with the kick. The kick is so good. Sanji walks away. A very weird look at interaction, but now with the implosion as well, Benny QT just sitting on the edge, the BMI as well. Hoda finds one, looking for another opportunity. He has a purple buff, so he can make the play, but it looks like he will get on out of there. Not enough. Sanji actually finds the final slash onto three targets, allowing him to get back in, but Carl says, that's what I've been waiting for. Takes them all out. The cleanup is a good, and Sanji still from Twisted Minds evens it up. Well done. As bloody as that assassins, which is weird because we haven't seen this as much in recent years. Mm -hmm. We usually see large exchanges, and now wait, Troll gets oh. the kick one more time. He's trying to make this actually happen. I mean, everybody's trying to make the play, and finally, Sanji from Twisted Minds pulls two under, but it's too late. Troll is already dead, and now the mid-tier one is going down as we see Call to Easy splitting on the opposite side. One be wanting Hoda, but look at the damage that Liquid Echo is applied to the Twisted Minds' map. Mid-tier one, now they're... Forces the Shunpo, gets the initial kick. Hey, this is not looking good. They're trying to change CCJP down, but it's honestly not even close. He tanks the damage and calls easy, goes it straight into the back line. Oh, the implosion fights one. They got Hoda, and now the rest of them will start to fall. It's not even remotely close.
Dude, he's it. like, this is like the good old days. And Sanji, he's just standing there menacingly. Finds the opportunity. Cuffin tries, but honestly, the rough waves ain't gonna connect on anybody. Final Slash already coming out as well. And now, that's Gauls easy. Just auto-attacking Troll. And that's just the end of the game. That's it. That's all they wrote. It was, <laughs> what? This is what they call in the streets a liquid stampede. Under 11 minutes. Liquid Echo. Here with us, the two-time world champ. Carl, congratulations with that sweep. We almost thought that you were gonna stick with Baksha, utility junglers, like you normally do, but you surprised us with that bling. I know Assassin is your comfort hero, so how does it feel that now Assassins are viable? It's uh, lang po sa feeling na nagagamit ko na yung mga hero na di ko pa nagagamit dati, tapos ano, parang he feels really good that now he's able to use the heroes that he wasn't able to use before because it's not part of the meta. But he feels that even though he's used sling, he's still a little bit short with his performance. So he thinks he can do better. I mean, look, honestly, looking at the game, from my perspective, he was pretty, he was doing pretty good against Twisted Minds. And it was an uphill battle, I want to say, for Twisted Minds, but he looked incredibly comfortable, I have to say. But I have one question for you, if you don't mind. Now, the MSC title, that's the one title that you are missing from essentially cementing yourself as the GOAT. Do you agree? Is that the one thing that you're just focusing on right now? Is that your only goal? Yung goal ko lang po talaga, di ko po iniisip yung parang last ano ko na, parang iniisip ko lang po para sa team manalo. Tapos siyempre yung pera din po. He's not thinking about cementing himself as the greatest of all time. What he's thinking about is the team and, of course, the prize money of 1 million USD. Now, thank you so much. Congratulations once again. All eyes are on you. So we're going to go back to our panelists. Break it down for us.